Hey guys, uh, this is Reconquista89, and this is March 9th, 2024. As for this series, what it technically is, is me trying to achieve certain life goals. The two main ones that I have right now are to get rid of all of my debt and also to get back to 170 pounds. So I guess I should, I guess, apologize for how bad I've been doing with these uploads. Video wise, we're on day 89, right? But real life, I'm like in day 105. So I fell off for about a week or two. So I'll try to catch up, probably do two or three of these a day. And we'll see how that goes. But um, yeah, I mean, it'll be fun to uh, read these back. And I can give more of an insight of how things turned out. And if there was things I was wondering about, I'll talk about them as well. But yeah, I'll start uploading them as well. I was thinking of just doing all those soccer games that I've been uploading first and then doing the Reconquista, but I can just do two at a time. I'll probably do one soccer game and then two Reconquista videos just so I can catch up because then it'll be like way too much if I try to do it uh, like all last minute and I'll be like way behind and then I'll know too much in the future <laughs> because a part of the series is the fun part, I believe, is that it's like day by day. And that kind of eliminates it, right? Because I'm speaking about it almost two weeks ahead of time. Uh, I've done this before. I don't want it to be a, what's it called? A, I was gonna, I don't say theory, I say a pattern. So, and that time it was pretty fun because you're like, you have questions and then the questions are answered later on. So I, have, I get the question, I talk about the question and I say what happened. But uh, for today, I wanted to wake up at 7.30, go to church at eight, Abs at 9, stretch at 9.30, edit at 10, grocery shop at 12, eat at 2, work at 3, and then go to sleep at 11. So what I actually ended up doing was I went, I woke up at 7.44, I went to church at 8.01, I was a little late, abs at 11.10, stretched at 11.34, I did not edit, of course. <laughs> and then uh, I did grocery shopping at 12.20. I ate at 6 p.m. I don't know why that was such a big gap there. I don't remember exactly. We might find out in notes and reflections right now. And I did not go to work because I went to go see a movie this day. I went to go see Dune 2. And I went to sleep at 12.30. As for the daily production, I did zero TikToks, zero Bumble Primes, um, zero Uber Eats for a total of $318.41 out of 667 for the week. For the fix, I put intro, taxes, applications, and a Kia class action lawsuit that they sent me. Since they broke into my car, somebody's doing a class action against them, and they told me to join it. All I have to do is send information and kind of send pictures of what happened. And that's pretty much easy to do, right? So I was like, I'll just do it. So just for the notes and reflection, I put it. These, sleep days, these sleepless days can be so dreadful at times. Day passes by, and you don't even notice. Went to watch Dune 2, and the movie was really good. It was very long, huh? <laughs> but it was still a very good movie. Yes, um, the movie was very long. It was extremely long. It was an extremely long movie. It was like almost three hours. I felt like there was two movies in there, but uh, I was entertained the whole time. And the first movie almost felt like it was building up to this one. I don't know if that makes sense. Like the first one was just a build up movie and then this one was like action when you know the action happened. Not just like fighting action, I mean more like the plot is advancing. I wanted to go eat after, but Brian had a soccer game, so I couldn't. Um Oh yeah. I think I was mad that I needed to take my brother to go play soccer. I feel like that week was just bad overall. I felt very um sort of like I didn't own my time. And it was unfair and stuff like that. Now looking back, I made my pieces. <laughs> I'm just like, ah, it's not a big deal. You know, I almost blamed it on Brian for his soccer because I do have to take him to practice and I do have to take him to his games. But in reality, it's just my mismanagement. But to be fair, sometimes it is a couple hours that I need to take off to do all that stuff. But if I was really about it, I would get get everything done. I really need ownership of my time again, so it's me complaining more. It'll be cool to only have to focus on my goals without intervention of other duties. 
I don't mind helping my family, but I don't like having to put all my stuff in the back seat to get their stuff done. But coming back to Dune, the whole story was so interesting. It made me reflect on the Bible a lot. The story is technically a copy of the Bible. Oh yes, I don't know. I don't know if you noticed, but like I, I read like a tweet once that like literally every story ever told is almost like a replica of the Bible. And then if you really see it, you can see like where they get their information. Like sometimes they just tell a story of one book in the Bible, or sometimes it's like an overlapping story of the whole thing. I think Star Wars was like a big one. And um, so yeah, once you see the comparisons, you're like, well, everybody's just stealing from one another. What is it? What is that saying? Like, there's no real new thought. Like, everything comes from something. The one thought that kept looking in my head was how how Paul wasn't actually a messiah, but all the propaganda was so great it couldn't be stopped. I had me thinking about the New Testament. People were also waiting for a messiah, so if one came and claimed the title, they could have gotten away with it. But with deeper thought, there's really no comparison. Paul was propaganda. Jesus Christ was divine. The setup for everything was designed perfectly. So when people doubt, uh, the theories don't make sense. God really did think of everything. And I do agree with that still. Because some people, uh, I've actually talked about this before, in like Bible study and stuff. But there's a certain belief that it could have all been fake. You know, that Jesus Christ wasn't actually the son of God. But... Uh, I mean, I can't comprehend it, I guess, in that sense. But everything is so perfectly set up for the book to have so many authors and for there to be so many connections that they all, like, interact with one another that it's literally impossible for it to be like, oh, yeah, like, this person made it up. There's no way that one person made it up if it has so many authors. The Messiah, I think I read something. There had been previous, like, people claiming to be the Messiah, but then there were frauds. Um, and that's why Jesus was performing all the miracles. And he really, what I think about it is like, he really had nothing to gain doing all this. He never asked for gold. He never wanted to be like, I guess, popular or fame. He didn't want the fame. So he was just doing this out of the kindness of his heart to save us, which is what the whole book is about, which is what the Bible is about, that he died for our sins. But, um, I don't think people understand that sometimes. I don't think I understand it perfectly either. But I just thought it was a good comparison. Like I said, comparing the media that we are being fed through movies and shows and stuff like that to the Bible, right? And like in this one, they were showing that uh, Paul Atreides wasn't a real Messiah, that it was all propaganda, that like they set up this seat so people are waiting and waiting for a Messiah. So when someone came, do sorry, doing the things the Messiah was supposed to do, they all just blindly took it in. They're like, yeah, like, this is it. This is who we've been waiting for. And I think they kind of made, made, I was almost like, are they trying to kind of like diminish Jesus Christ? That's what I was thinking during the movie. I was like, I don't know. Is that the overall method? But yeah, it's pretty much it. So for the calories I had today, it was 2,703 and I weighed 228 points since. 28 228.6 but that's pretty much it see you guys next time yes